Hey there, so after I posted the Crash Twin Sanity uh, prototype demo, I noticed a couple of people in the comments had mentioned that there was an extra path on the level. If we cut to the level and have a look, you can see on the wall here, there's some wall paintings that show something happening to the left hand route on the path. Now, down there, there is a hole in the ground in the prototype, and when you fall in it, um, there's nothing there. It's just, it's just a hole in the ground. But I managed to find a newer prototype that actually had some of that level built out. So we'll go over there and have a look now. Okay, so as I say, this is a newer prototype. This was uh, in February, I think towards the end of February, um, 2004. So it's a more recent build. Um, so it's obviously in that time before the section was cut. I think it was cut due to it being just way too hard. Um, you can see here the, uh, the paintings on the wall. So the one here, which is the normal gameplay route, showing that you jump on the sort of alien mole to get upwards. And there's Neo waiting to trigger that. But if we look the other way, this painting shows this guy being chased by a load of beetles, by the looks of it, or bugs. So this was Bug Run, which was cut because it was too hard. So here's the hole, which in the last prototype was just a hole. You just went in there, there's nothing in it. Um, and at first glance, I thought it was the same thing. I went in here, had a look around, and couldn't find anything in it. Um, but then I thought, well, look, what happens if we turn up the brightness a bit um, in the video? And then you can see that actually there is a little tunnel here which leads through to what would have been the bug run section. So let's, let's go through and have a look. There's no bugs in it. Well, there might be bugs in it, like programming, it might crash. <laughs> but there's none of the uh, bugs that are meant to chase you through the level. Uh, so you can see it's kind of all underground caves, very different to the above ground sections. And uh, if we turn around, get the camera the other way, this is the viewpoint that the level would have played at. So you would have started the level from here. The camera would have swung around, you start running, and then suddenly all these bugs would pour Pour, pour out behind you and start chasing you uh, into the screen. The camera would have probably been further back than this, um, so you could have more anticipation of the things coming. Um, and in fact, I'm going to turn the camera around because it's pretty tricky to play not seeing what's coming up. So uh, avoid this uh, kind of bits of masonry and stuff, pillars in the way will swerve around those. Um, nice light coming in from the ceiling. Uh, this is quite, actually quite a long section. Um, there's pits here that you would need to jump over. Oh, it's insta-death. Again here, this is avoiding another pit up these steps. And you, you can see below, you'd have had to jump that. More pillars to swerve around. And again, you can imagine doing all this backwards with bugs chasing you, not being able to really see what was coming would be, as, as the team realized, just a, way, a, a, a small amount too difficult to do. Um, avoiding all these hazards, uh, which is why it was cut. And I think there is a similar section later in the game, once the game gets much harder. And then here, this pit here is just, I'm not sure if those moving platforms meant to be here, just too hard. But luckily I have a, a debug jump, which would make boundary break, uh, pleased, uh, <laughs> to get over that, that particular hazard. And we can keep making our way down the section. And I would imagine the section would end as you ran through this hole in the wall. Or maybe actually all the bugs would have fallen down the pit that we just had to hover over and you'd have used platforms to get across. And then we just, this would be a more open area, I guess with uh, Wampa to collect um, and explore. And then as we get through this section here, we'll find some steps. They're uh, not the easiest steps to jump on, especially this one, it's a little high for a double jump, but it can be done. And then we'll jump our way back up here. And we're back outside the level. And actually, we've ended up to the right-hand side of uh, where we started. So you can see over here, here's Neo waiting to give you the tutorial on how to bounce on these mole things. So we haven't skipped any of the gameplay. Um, it, so it's an entirely a bonus section. Um, I'm just going to skip out of this. Um, but we can see this is where this is where we would have started off that section. So. That's Bug Run. Imagine it full of bugs and uh, you get a good idea of what's going on. Um, I hope you enjoyed that. As always, like, subscribe, click the bell, whatever. And I'm sure I'll find some more Twin Sanity stuff in the near future. All right, take care. Bye-bye.